So this is where we've woken up this morning. Yeah, really appreciate all the comments on the fear issue. Um, thanks to Brian again for getting us a drink. Um, it was well needed last night. We had a drink last night in the Moho and uh, everybody's uh, comments about kind of like um, fuel out of it, you know, putting some um, DPF cleaner in and stuff like that. And uh, I've done a, um, this morning, I've done a um, disconnection of the battery. Uh, I haven't disconnected the battery for a minute or two, so I've just re um, disconnected the battery and uh, had another little route around. So um, we'll see what maps out today, but uh, I just had to come down here, show you this bridge. And uh, it's been a pretty windy night, to be honest. Very, very windy, but uh, the sky behind is looking rather black. So we're just uh, making the best of it. Can I walk across this bridge? <laughs> Crikey. I don't think I'm gonna um, attempt it, I don't think. There's a lot of cars about this morning, but... Um it's uh, pretty nice, I must admit. We also had quite a few comments about the extreme weather they're having in Europe at the moment. And uh, we noticed the level of water coming down this river yesterday. We're like, look how much water is down here. But um, I don't even think it's, um, I think it does, might even get higher, I don't know. But uh, it looks like there's been some uh, serious storms down this way as well. Probably like we had in Croatia. Certainly a expanse of water. Whoa. I'm just gonna uh, go up a little, little bit further, as we do, Tuesday morning. Whoa, let's have a lot. It's uh, uh, two-way two -way traffic. A truck just went over it and it's, you can almost feel your, the ground shaking, honestly. Oh my goodness me. Right, I think there's a beautiful castle over here as well. I haven't got a, I haven't got a clue what this town is called. Um, it was real last minute, dot com last night, as we um, arrived here at this park up in sort of desperation, really. Just needed to park up after yesterday. But hopefully the wind, there's still a fair bit of wind about at the moment. Um, hopefully this wind, because yesterday it was getting super strong coming up the, uh, the pay road. It's uh, a real epic sky this morning. Blue sky that way. Right, I'm going to get back, I think.
up to this morning. Well, I suppose I can give you an update now, actually, while we're driving. We are just on the outskirts of Lyon. And what happened this morning? We left the park in and I decided, I thought, oh, right, I'm going to give it one last shot. I'm going to go up to a uh, diagnostics place not far from there. It was only about 10 miles up the road, so we were, it was north anyway. So we proceeded on up there. Um, the guy was too busy, recommended us to another place. <laughs> so you just get into this uh, like rhythm. Anyway, um, so all right, we'll give it the benefit of the doubt. It en ended up being like a camper car, um, motorhome dealership, basically, and uh, it was a non from them. Um, so basically then they sent me then to a, no uh, another Fiat garage and uh, I stood, I've, I've spent God knows how long just waiting at receptions just while they, you know, sort of trying to be right after two miles. dealing with customers and stuff. Anyway, I waited, I waited, I waited, and then it's kind of like, no, we haven't got time. And I'm like, okay. Uh, they recommended me to another one uh, that was another half an hour up the road, and we'd got close then. It was get, to get to the second one, it was going to be close to 12 o'clock and everything shuts up 12 till 2 nothing happens so that was the end of that we decided to uh, cut our losses and um, basically oh it's a bit of Leon as well in the distance this is what Leon looks like <laughs> if you're wondering bit of a futuristic building looking there isn't it but um, yeah, so then we ended up, the light had been on all this time. So I said, right, I'm gonna get back out. Let's um, go, f go for it again on the pay road. So that's what we did. And uh, I probably started driving for, I reckon I'd been driving for five miles. Yeah. Probably done five miles on the payage and uh, all of a sudden I just it just felt like my power had come back a little bit I glanced down and my light had gone off and we're probably looking at three quarters an hour later now and the light is still off at the moment so we are we're cracking on um, yeah so so it just seems to be like low speeds at the moment, unless something's uh, drastically changed. But uh, we'll keep our fingers crossed and leave with, well, there's some superb views up here, up the river, look, look at this, what a road. I'm just gonna uh, sneak over in a minute. It's just so refreshing to get you get the power back. And I was running it in like manual when I had the issues because then I can control it a bit better, the revs. But um, it really got confused in the uh, automatic. But at the moment, the pressure is off. Cool. So we, well, we've, we've covered a bit of ground this morning. We've got four, I've got my sat-nav set to Dieppe at the moment. Oh, one last story. Hang on, I'm going to, shall I leave the camera running around that way? You, do you want to sit? Yeah, now you'd rather watch Lee on than my ugly mug, really, wouldn't you? Yeah. Um, <laughs> leave us a comment. <laughs> What, even a real dark black tunnel in Lyon? <laughs> Leave us a comment. Um, yeah, so anyway, um, then we were, yeah, I think we just left that last dealership and then it was right, right, I need some gas before I go out on the payage. So we ended up um, pulling into a gas station. It was one of these, um, I don't know, like Neto or something, I don't know what the hell it was. But anyway, yeah, we sort of pulled in and I ended up almost driving in the garage to the wrong. It was um, a pay it pump, so there was no kiosk or nothing. It was just a bit, bit basic. Oh, all right. And um, 
so we ended up um, pulling in the kind of like wrong way and uh, there was a um, French woman and a guy in this van and they she was just literally looking at me shaking her head with a real deadpan face on it was we, we were in hysterics we were like look what you know why are you so serious my dear literally when she so you know and she was just shaking her head and we were I was just like put me thumb up to her and she was like <laughs> but we were cracked up absolutely cracked up we were like you you guys really need to uh, take a chill pill we're English we don't know where the hell we're going um, it was funny but hey ho let's see what's on the other end of this tunnel just views of Lyon out of the tunnel views of Lyon welcome to Lyon now we've got a fence in the way <laughs> It was all looking really bright. Um, that was around Lyon and stuff like that when it was all like happy yeah. days. And then um, a little bit later on, we just had the dreaded ping and uh, it returned. So uh, anyway, we carried on and I'm kind of thinking, well, uh, do you know what? I might even just let me maybe go for a sensor. The, there's a couple of exhaust um, sensors. Uh, Anyway, so I thought, right, I'm going to maybe bite the bullet. Let's see if we can find another uh, Fiat dealership. And um, if they've got some parts, let's see what they got. See if I can um, change the these sensors, maybe. So uh, in I goes. It was a little bit out in the country, so it was looking a bit grim. And uh, no, he, he didn't have any um, parts. He would get them from another place, uh, this particular one that wouldn't fall off the motorway so in the meantime I said oh by the way have you got any um, what about some uh, EGR valve um, injector cleaner and he's like we've got some we've got some really good stuff it's totally recommended so I'm like right so we've uh, emptied that in the diesel tank and uh, got back out on the motorway I've got about we, well we had about 100 uh, miles to go and so we're down actually to 80 now so we've been running for about like um, two, uh, 20 miles uh, we're running on to a camper car park camping car park stopover and uh, so I'm sort of just want to rinse it up as fast as I can I'm using like manual well, gear changes wind as well, right? yeah it's a bit windy it, but um, I'm sort of keeping rolling but it's, it gets a little bit slow on hills uh, but anyway we're gonna um, rinse this fluid through it hopefully uh, by the time we get there it should have had a good old uh, rake around in the tank and get through the fuel system so we'll see what happens so we had a few comments on this stuff so that's what we're going to um, we're going to try anyway so we'll still let you know what happens well i think we've actually um bought a french road <laughs> the amount we're paying but um it's a uh, fast moving operation 
2080, wasn't it? Yeah. Euros, yeah. yeah. So Sucking we money up. we are <sighs> definitely giving the, the first giving the French a lot of uh, euros for their roads. There's no other way we can do this. Sir, really? No, no. So we'd have, we'd have been uh, the distance we've been today would have been all all absolutely all. We've been like half a day now. I think I started driving about twelve, so it's now five thirty, something like that. Yeah. So we're going to. Um, it's our little random pick of uh, camping car park tonight again. Yes. A place called Le Moors. After 180 yards, go over the roundabout, taking the second exit. So it's now Tuesday, the 17th of September. It is quite warm actually, it's 20, 21 degrees. Whoa. And uh, take the second exit. A little bit of respite with our um, camping car park card because I still had a fair, I had a fair bit of uh, credit still left on it, which um, I think the last time we actually used it was in Portugal. Yeah. It was that, um, oh, I can't think of the name of it now, but it was the Portugal. And we were struggling to get out of the barrier and I uh, loaded, I th thought I didn't have enough on it, so we loaded a bit more money on it. So we've st we've, we're still in credit from that one. So um, we're hoping, well it's going to, um, and we checked our balance this morning, so we've still got probably another two nights worth left on there, so that's always a bonus. Oh, this looks a bit of an unused, oh, so we were going over the river. Yeah over the river and we have got like a very unusual looking church over there. Very nice. See the back of it like it's yeah. almost like we'll take a walk up. Uh, we have got six minutes, we've got a mile and a half to the park up. Just uh, having a giggle amongst ourselves <laughs> uh, because we actually went totally the wrong way. Oh, a, oh, 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 um, and now we're in the back streets and we're sort of meeting people that give you real funny looks. Oh, what's it? What's it? Right, okay. This is going to be a better, better plan. Up on the end, I reckon, somewhere up here. Scenic. Yeah, it is. Whoa, whoa. I reckon it's over that bridge. It's up here. Oh, is it? I 
reckon, up around this corner. And... Did you, I thought you were looking out over the water. It's close, isn't it? Hang on, let me have a look. Let me have a look. There's the oh, air. There There's is. the air. There's the air. So There's the air. Hang on. Yeah. Right. Hang on. Hang on. It's alright. We got it. We got it. We got it. We got it. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bonjour. Bonjour, madame. Oops. All right, all right, we got it. We got it. <laughs> look at him, look at that. Oh, look, we got it. Oh, it's a little bar there. Down by the river. Right, we're going to, fingers crossed, there was quite a few spaces earlier on. Yeah, we're so we're hoping that, that uh, no. there's going to be enough room yeah. for a seven meter small one. This is cool. Card. Card out the holder, cards okay. in Caroline's hand. Make sure you get up to the back. Shed loads of spaces. I want to see you. I'm not parking on the drain. No, we'll <laughs> find the space. Right? No worries. We're on it. You go on and I'll walk up with my legs as much. Right, okay. There it goes. Right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go disco. Let's go disco. So, English Auto Trail. Right, let's get a river view. This. 